leave below the poverty threshold. A research study by a coalition of non-governmental organizations says during a poverty scanning and mapping in Sambonga City. It says that 50.6% of the city population suffers from lack of basic needs, unemployment, and inadequate income. The high poverty rate is attributed to the absence or lack of employment opportunities, inequality in the distribution of wealth and access to resources, is an older situation, failing to gain access to credit technological and market information and other services. strategy to fight poverty requires understanding the problem, identifying its major causes and manifestations, and choosing the instruments and the targets of public intervention. Through this documentary, we wish to help identify what interventions we can assist on and give priorities to areas affected by the program. In the last 10 years, poorer families had less access to basic education, preventive health care, family planning services, and safe drinking water. Among the 98 barangays of Sambuanga City, at least 33 are priority areas with inadequate sanitary toilet facilities, high malnutrition, and infant death rate, and no access to safe drinking water and electricity. Conditions in urban areas are better with respect to dwellings. may be necessary to focus resources on families and areas where the probability of coping with poverty is possible. Economic indicators of family, awareness and use of family planning methods, housing, water and sanitation conditions of the families, availability of credit to finance the family business or enterprise, and other demographic and economic characteristics are not immediately available in this documentary but we urge the government and other institutions to help in providing this. Policymakers and program implementers have better information to evaluate, sharpen the focus, and enhance the impact of anti-poverty programs. What 
this project wants to indicate is that this documentary can be used to mobilize actions at different levels of governance, especially at the community level, where appropriate and timely response can make the most impact on the living conditions of the poor. The primary responsibility for reducing poverty with the local government, civil society, can be a strong ally in efforts to alleviate poverty. This project, therefore, comes at a time when the census of the government and other agencies are needed to formulate poverty reduction programs and improve income distributions as the main trust. The following music video is a tribute to the underprivileged who continue to hope that better lives await them in the near future. Oh, no. 